turban and tunic there's a to symbolize Vietnamese beauty. They appear in festivals, stages and in domestic and foreign cultural exchange programs. Each Vietnamese is always proud when wearing this outfit. Turbans are divided into three categories Turban for men, Turban for women, and one type for both men and women. As for Turban for men, there is a butt in the backside and a peak in the front. Strips for making turbans are iron, embroidered or decorated with sequin patterns. The front side of the turban is made of the word human, the left side crosses the right side. Each type of turban has different number of rings. The higher the number of rings is, the harder it is to make a turban, because craftsmen have to be careful. Patterns are in the shapes of dragons, phoenixes and lotuses or those ordered by customers. Sequin patterns are also made by hand. After being completed, the turbans will be dried. At this time of the year, the village is full of colorful turbans. The whole hamlet all makes turbans for the festival season. Those who have strong bonds with the village understand how the place has changed. People of all generations are always concerned about the craft. Younger generations are proud to inherit the craft. Each turban is an outcome of hundreds of years of long experience and creativity. Currently, in order to meet the market tastes, designs, styles and colors of turbans, to diversify. In addition to normal turbans, there are turbans used at spiritual celebrations, ceremonies and festivals. Villagers also make turbans used in traditional music concerts. Turbans for bright or turbans used in longevity ceremonies, were also provided. Depending on the purpose, the number of creases is varied. However, to ensure product quality as well as the price of products, materials are carefully chosen. This is the most important stage. Currently, Jiakadhat Hamlon has seven facilities of seven households making turban. Each facility employs 20 families. Each family is in charge of a specific stage of turban making process. Today, thanks to machinery, ideally, a person can make 100 cores per day. In this way, such owners as trunk can save cost of renting workshops. However, it's necessary to closely monitor the production. Such meeting is also an opportunity for a local authority to reinforce the strength of craft villages. Each person in each generation has its own way to preserve and develop the traditional craft. Turbans are made all the year round to prepare for the consumption in January, February and August, when many festivals take place. These products are mainly sold in northern provinces, and now are exported to South Korea and Canada.